Hey, this is Glidden Cameron, day nine, the power of six. It's going to be a lot of power on this day. Can you feel it? It's coming. You will need very open mind, 10 to 18 minutes per day. To be something, you must do something. That is what the power of six is. It's about doing stuff, making things happen. I have learned so much about life in the gym. It's just not funny. Look at that guy up there. He's utilizing his organic machine that's called the body. Did you know that as human beings, we have many limiters that seem to be built in, which means we're not as powerful as we're capable of being. If you, you know, just to give you a quick lesson, strength is a function of the nervous system, which means the more efficient your nervous system is, the stronger you are, which is why someone can become a power lifter and lift a lot of weight. Someone that says weighs 140 pounds because they've made their nervous system extremely efficient. They could lift 400, 500, 600 pounds even because they've made it's because they've become extremely efficient. And that's one of the things. Did you know that because of these limiters, that if you could fully recruit all of your muscle fibers, lifting a car would be nothing. That is how much we're limited. And where the biggest limitations tend to lie are in the brain. It's estimated that we're using four or 5% of our abilities mentally. So if you could crank it up another percentage point, and yeah, say you're at 4% and you crank it up another percentage point, that's a 20% increase. To compare and to contrast, say you got a 20% increase on your paycheck. <laughs> you can feel that, right? It's real easy math. I mean, it doesn't take a lot. You'd be like, hmm, that's really nice. Now, let's get nasty. Let's get really, really nasty. Say you're using 5%, right? Using 5%. And you crank it up to 7%. That's a 35% increase in utilizing your mental abilities. 35%. Let's 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 do this. Let's do this. Say, say you make 5,000 a month. Just to he goes, we like numbers here. Everyone loves numbers. And you got a 35% increase. A $1,750. Let's divide that by two. It's an $875 increase per week at 35%. Now, why am I hammering on about increasing, increasing? Well, Day nine, powering up is a stretch exercise. In powerlifting, there's a phase in which intensity is reduced as part of the regimen. Before you reduce, you must raise the level of focus. That's what we're doing today. We're going to raise the level of the focus. Right now, you've been doing one, two, like two, three, four things, five things. Well, today, you're, going to, you're putting 12 things on the list. 12, yes, 12. Which 12? Any 12. The goal is to get as many things done in 24 hours as possible. Now, I'm like, yo, Glendon, you said this was the power of six. Well, let me explain it to you. By increasing the intensity, when you go back to a lower intensity, which is your norm, it doesn't seem so hard. I'll give you an example. About 18 months ago, deadlifting 400 pounds was pretty hard for me to could do it when I when I was able to get to that level I, I could do one rep and I felt it I mean it was a strain I was grinding it out I was like grinding it out like a bear in the gym I can now walk in the gym on any lower body day because I do deadlifts and squats and donkey calf raises. that's it and walking in you know in the morning I can go in there and put 400 pounds on the bar and deadlift I usually do three to four. I could probably do eight, maybe 10 reps, but I'm not into the whole rep thing. I use the deadlift as a warm up for my squats because I'm more focused on getting bigger legs. And 
you pretty much just training my stabilizer muscles. But the whole point is what was extremely difficult and challenging for me has become exceptionally easy for me because I've trained past it. That's why this is a stretch exercise. We're going to stretch your capabilities because you go ahead and like get these 12 things done, right? You, you're, you, your self-confidence is just going to go like, whoa, I am the man. I am the man or I, I'm the woman. You, you're going to be like that. And then there's will be some more stretch exercises because once you make your norm simple and you develop the procedures and the process, then you become more efficient. And by becoming more efficient and process oriented, you get more stuff done on a consistent basis, which is the foundation for success. So this is your task for day nine. The goal is to get as many of the 12 things done as possible within 24 hours. 12 things, 24 hours. Go. This is Glendon, and I'll see you in the next session.